Hello friends, welcome to Global Power BI User Group. So from last week, we launched our Global Power BI virtual website that is globalpowerbi.com. We will encourage you to join and sign up for our website so that you will get all the latest update. So why we are here today? So we are here today to solve one of the very important question asked by a Venkatraman. I'm not able to spell his name. Let's call him VB. So VB have very interesting problem that he wants to have a custom logo in all of his Power BI sheets so that he can change that particular image and it will get reflected in all the sheets. So that's how I understood the problem. Let's see what is the solution. So for that, what I did is I uploaded two images on my personal website that is 1.png that is test1 and the test2. So these are two different images. So let's see how we can fetch this image inside a Power BI desktop as well as in Power BI service. So let's open a blank Power BI desktop file and here we are going to use a enter data option so that we will have a quick turnaround for this problem. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to copy this particular URL and I'm going to paste the URL. Let's load it. Once I loaded that particular URL inside my Power BI desktop, I'm going to go in a data mode and inside the data mode, I'm going to select the column. Once you are going to select the column, go to modeling and convert that particular data category into image URL. This is the most important point here. You have to convert this particular column in image URL. So I converted that into image URL. Let's go back to our simple dashboard. And now when I am fetching this particular column here, you can see the test one is displayed over here, my website image. Now let's publish this recording into the powerbi.com. Hit on publish button and let's see how that Power BI desktop file looks into Power BI service. So I click on to the app.powerbi.com link. So here you can see the test one image and now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go in my FTP and I'm going to rename 1.png to anything that is 999 and my second image which is nothing but this test 2 image what I am going to do I am going to rename that particular image with 1.png so now my test 1 image becomes now test 2 you can see in the browser it's already reflecting so let's see I have not changed anything on my Power BI desktop side I'm going to hit just refresh and let's see whether it's fetching the new logo or new image where you can see the new image has been already displayed on my Power BI service. So here is how you can have an image URL and how you can change the image without changing Power BI desktop file. Still you can get a dynamic image content in the Power BI service. I'm going to post this video soon and thank you for the other users also who have replied David Asgur and those who have helped VB to solve this problem. So stay tuned and see what we are doing in globalpowerbi.com and sign up for that. Thank you.